and welcome back to the 2020 Hack the NAB Show. We've been hacking through the best new product releases, features, and updates. Now we are bringing on our friends from X Keys, coming in all the way from Michigan. That's right. Yeah, yeah, Michigan. How you guys doing? Good. Okay. <laughs> How are you doing? Not too bad. What is that spiny little creature behind you? You you said it right. That is Spiny. That is the X Keys mascot. Yep. So he figured he could join today. <laughs> All right. We'll let him in. We'll let him in. So guys, uh, thank you so much for being part of our giveaway. I don't know if you ca caught that, but the very great Dean Spur is going to be help saving lives of uh, folks who are affected by rare diseases. That is fantastic. So cool. That's awesome. You know, totally out of the blue, random, and it it brings me to my first, my last question, which we'll do, we'll do you guys in reverse. You know, it, 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 everything is changing. Everything is different. And uh, many of us are in a situation where we're able to help and give back and be part of a solution um, for folks who are trying to communicate and stay connected. What has the story for X Keys been like over the past couple of weeks? Um, yeah, so uh, we're actually, um, you know, with the whole Zoom thing and everybody having to work from home now, uh, people have been using Zoom a lot more. Obviously, that's what we're on now. But um, we are in the process of putting together a Zoom for, or X keys for Zoom. So it's going to be a dedicated controller with, um, all you have to do is download the utility and program your X keys, and then you'll have it all laid out, ready to go. So that should help a lot of people. Yeah, there's oh a lot of gosh. shortcuts within Zoom. I don't know if you even realize that, but as somebody who's never used Zoom before and you have to host a meeting or you're attending a meeting, there are a lot of keystrokes and anyone who knows X keys knows that's exactly what we're meant to do is to uh, make you more efficient and faster at what you're doing. So yeah, like Miranda said, we're going to do the XK24, which is what you gave away, which is this guy. So we're <laughs> going to do the XK24 dedicated for Zoom. Hopefully we'll have something by Friday. Right now it's not going to cost you anymore. Um, it's going to be a utility you can download or you can buy one. Hopefully we'll have them on the shelf. We're very limited at who's in the office right now. If anyone doesn't know, Michigan's actually under a state lockdown still. Yep. So we're only shipping out once a week, which has been difficult, <laughs> um, but we're doing the best we can. So yeah, we're really excited to be able yeah. to offer a tool to help people stream right now the best we can so and we'll have those legends available for download off of our website too so that way you don't have to write on your legends of what they're supposed to be yeah. okay because this is really interesting so I, I obviously i have one of those here um at my studio and i use zoom all the time so i could print out that legend and then use a utility on my computer to yep. make it basically work for zoom mm -hmm. yeah Yep, it's gonna wow. load the script right for you so that way you're just and it'll be in hardware mode at that point so you won't have to have software running in the background exactly. um you just have to enable the keyboard within zoom so we'll have more details on that uh, not to plug our own <laughs> show but we have been streaming once a week now that we're in the yep. basement um so i think this friday we're gonna have a little bit more details on that so yeah. wow now <laughs> that is ingenuity uh i'm really excited to see that that is something that i mean 20 million people a day are downloading Zoom. That's and I was crazy. talking to Andrew Cross about that. This is going to change the way we all think about going back to work whenever that happens. Because, uh, you know, we've 20 million people a day, I mean, for five weeks. I mean, we're yeah. talking about a billion people being exposed to video conferencing for the first time. Zoom being the mm -hmm. one that most people are being exposed to. And when we go back to work and we say, you know, uh oh, Jim can't attend the meeting. Well, Jim, you can attend the meeting. Just join right. Zoom. Um, yeah. And, you know, I am so excited to see that controller. I could see it going into now. Zoom has something called a Zoom room, uh, which is designed for a conference room. So they give you an iPad and it has a customized controller. So this would be more for the personal user. Um, yeah. Yeah. Which there's so many power users out there. I cannot wait to transform oh, yeah. my 24 key x keys into doing that um yeah, i mean we really got the been, wheel spinning yeah i mean my sister is a high school teacher she has never had to host a zoom meeting before and she was one of the persons that i immediately thought of because she doesn't realize how many keystrokes are in the world she's a biology teacher like she does a lot of hands-on stuff so like people like her 
that are now having to host, it can be a little intimidating to not only get all your students. I mean, especially like even with these churches, people that are, are streaming now that may not have been doing it before. That's just one less thing they can worry about is, is the control. So hopefully yeah. we'll have something quick. Um, our team's working on it right now. Right. We've all been staying in contact as best we can. Um, while we've been working remote so well i am so excited and when it's available i want to bring you on the show and really really talk about it um it's so smart and uh it's funny a couple of things come to mind one is our good friend gary batan from video guys uh was unable to close his screen share today and we had to do it for him but you know hey um he, i don't think I don't, that's what kids are for. No, but I don't think that, um, that he would mind us kind of poking fun at him because he's probably going to know exactly why you made this product. Cause it would work great mm -hmm. for him. Now you've right. only got 24 keys. Tell right. can you, can you share a little bit of what are some of these keys going to be able to do in zoom? Yeah. So just some of them, like it's simple things. Like when you go to your, when you hover over your screen on zoom, um, you can see that the start and stop video, you can mute your audio. Like that's, a few of them uh, change it from host view to or speaker view to gallery view uh, or grid view. I'm not sure which way they call it. Gallery or grid, one of the two. Um, bring up the chat and then just a few things like that. And also share screen. We have that. We're using that one as well. So and stop share. I would imagine it's on there. Mm -hmm. Yep. Wow. Yep, and stop share. So it's just like it seems common sense stuff but it's just taking the complication out of it which is what xps are great for yeah. so like i said we're not charging anymore for it right now we're just really trying to help people so yeah do what we can well so. if you want to know what i think i think you need to tell the world about it and you need to have the x you need to have the zoom sales team the <laughs> five thousand of them tell their customers about it yeah, we'll make we, sure to get you something, Paul, yeah. for sure. Well, I have one, so I just need to I know, software. but we'll make sure we send you the info as soon as we have it ready. Once yes. we get it ready, we'll send Please you the legends do. and, and Send me the legends because I want to set that up immediately. I okay. use Zoom all the time, and I'm just, that's just, it's just so smart. You guys, you guys amazed me. I wasn't <laughs> sure. And you know what's funny is my question to you, I think, now getting to the top of the question list, I we flipped it. Um but maybe, maybe you answered it already. The first question I've asked everyone is what were you planning to announce at NAB? You've totally re-engineered and redesigned <laughs> one of your products to, to fix the, one of the most biggest problems that the world's having right now. How the heck do I use Zoom, Nanny, Nancy? You know, there's that joke. Everyone's like, Nancy, you know, it's down there. Unmute yourself. It's that button right, right. there. <laughs> you got her some X keys. But what were you planning on releasing an NAB before all of this? Well, see, that's almost like a double-edged question right now. So what we were going to talk about was going to be something really, really, really cool. It was going to be something with one of the biggest partners in the broadcast industry at NAB. But since the Olympics are postponed, they haven't released their press release yet to talk about what they're doing. And so we actually can't talk about what we were going to show off at NAB. Oh. Um, yeah, but it's a really custom OEM project. It was just going to highlight how great our engineering team is, and our marketing team and our graphics, everything that we can do is all in one big package. Um, so it's something totally custom for this customer. It's, it's multiple hundred piece orders. So it's going to be worldwide and hopefully using the Olympics. So anyone who's hopefully going to NAB New York, I'm hoping that we can make an appearance mm -hmm. there maybe and show it off or at least have a, an update by then. I'm not sure if the Olympics are even happening this year. So sorry to bust your uh, bubble on that one. I'm glad we could talk about the Zoom, but that was going to be the highlight of our booth. Yeah. And now we can't even talk about it. So okay okay it's, it's, all right. it's, coming. it's all right because because i think you guys are really going to nail this next question out of the park here you're going to hit it out of the park so the next question is and i i feel like i feel like you guys are in school or something you guys don't have to be scared about this it's just a, i only have three questions it's not like you're going to fail the test or anything um but um because you're just like oh boy uh oh what is this? I, I think i sent these to you in advance but yeah, anyway yeah. um the second question <laughs> is this tell me about a customer you know we're here at hack the nab show and 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 in many many people who are in the streaming and broadcast industry we're hacking together a system you know we're adding one thing changing the next and i feel like you guys are really get involved with a lot of customization projects tell us one because i know that the makers of uh the simpsons use x keys 
and I know that a lot of creators love their X keys. Tell me about a one that really surprised you that you heard about where somebody hacked something together. You said, I don't think you can do that. And they figured out how to do it. One that really surprised us. I mean, you brought up the Simpsons one. That was that really one. cool because that was a live animation. Well, you could tell us about that process. one. Oh, um, yeah. So with Adobe Character Animate, um, they actually use, and it, use our X keys to uh, do the first ever live Simpsons show. So it was controlling Homer Simpson giving responses. If anybody caught that episode, but it was actually really cool. And um, but yeah, and so they just used Adobe and. Adobe character anime. I can't say that very well. <laughs> yeah, so that was really neat. Yeah. Um, our stuff is used everywhere. Like you said, one of the favorite things that I like, it's not really a hack, but I'm really into football. I'm into college football and DB Sports, actually one of our bigger customers, and they've used an XK24 on the field, in the booth, out there for replay. So that's always one of my favorite things to see it out actually on the field um, in use. So yeah. that's one of my favorite ones. I was like, that's an XK <laughs> while I'm watching football. So it's always fun to see. Yeah. Do you got so a lot of people are saying hi, obviously. Rudy's saying hi in the chat room. You know, hey, Rudy, people are hey. afraid that they're sad that the Olympics is canceled. Um uh, Kyle Gunderman wants to set up his XK24 for his wife to use Zoom. Uh right. blowing my mind. Do you guys want to share your screen and take a look at some of the X keys uh products that people might not know about? Because I know you guys have more uh out yeah. there. You know, it always surprises me the different you guys have foot pedals um yep. big sets of Foot keys pedals. small sets of keys yep. yep switch interfaces uh we have basically almost any size you could think of we even have the little xk3 switch interface that you can hook up just one button to mm -hmm. we have our giant 128 key which i know you guys use a shout out to telestream for showing that a little bit ago with jeremy really appreciate yeah. that we love our wirecast version of it uh, we have the jog shuttle 12 that editors use we have little sticks right there we actually have the xk40 miranda's been using while we've been doing the stream with yeah. bmix at home these longer strip ones are really nice to when you don't have a space um you can actually slide in next keys yep, wherever right you can here. fit it um yeah like you said foot pedals and you can use unlimited x keys which is something really cool a lot of people don't realize so you're not limited to just one keyboard. You can plug in 10 of them, five of them, whatever you need. We yeah. usually have a solution for, so. Got the replay controller. Yep, um, replay one was a fun one. You guys did a cool little show with that. <laughs> this is a fun yeah. one right here. Um, joystick for yeah. Xbox yeah. adaptive controller. So um, we got that working with them. And yep, that works that? From, uh, Yep, that works in the from uh, Microsoft's Xbox Adaptive Controller, so you can actually plug that directly into it, and it just gives you that many more buttons for your joystick controller, which is great for anyone um, that needs an assistive technology product that doesn't maybe not have a lot of use on a regular game controller. The Xbox Adaptive one is really big. Um, it has large buttons on it, so we worked with them on that. So that was something we came out with Ooh. just last fall, I think. Uh, we have our HD15s. We have our GPIO box now that you can control different lighting yep, switch interfaces got just one buttons literally you need one red button <laughs> i like that because I, I i really need that sometimes to be honest i have one of those i'm telling you yeah, yeah that's, that, that's the cool... off button in our studio yeah right <laughs> um back to college sports so one of the cool things i just remembered cbs one year for march madness i talked to a guy he was telling me that during the 170 games or whatever that go on, he actually had one of our XK3 switch interfaces with one red button in the middle of these giant million dollar switchers. And that was what swiped the screens. So it's like, you hear about these setups that are just out of the park and then you slide an XKs in there for sometimes, like you just said, when you just need one button, so. Right, and speaking of sports, we've got our uh, track, track, track time and control pads as well. Oh, what do those do? All the, those different softwares. Uh, Helping control like uh, high tech or uh, yep, that's track timing software. Yeah. So we have there's a lot of people that volunteer that sit out and actually track runners when they're running, do cross country and that sort mm. of stuff. And there's a ton of shortcuts in there. And so we actually designed XQs. We worked with high tech and uh, have an XQs controller for that now. So you can yeah. sit out there and instead of trying to use your mouse and your laptop, you can just have an XQ sitting in your lap and check all the times. And I'm not sure what the functions are on there, but anyone who does track timing, so. Um, Oh, there's like those the foot, join. those foot switches. Yep, foot switches. Those are um, designed to work with our switch interfaces. Yep. 
So we have one that supports one, we can support up to three. We also have one that supports up to 12. You can mount them places. We actually will work with any button that is a three and a half mono plug. So we can get pretty crazy with the switches that you plug in. Yeah. All different stuff. Oh, I'm so yeah. sad we're not at NEV this year. This is one of my favorite things is to show off our entire family of XE. So thank you for bringing that up, Paul. <laughs> Yeah, I know. It's uh, I don't, that's why I like going to your now. What is that PTZ key kit? Oh, I guess that's go. for for the keys. Yeah, well, that is actually part of the giveaway. So that set of twelve. I'm not sure if you guys had that in your giveaway, but we are going to include that. So these are acrylic keys that we actually make in house. Anyone who has an XDs right now, you probably have seen the legends that go underneath the keycap. Well, these are actually acrylic printed keys. So we've made a couple different sets, mm -hmm. like our broadcast key set, our Adobe sets. This is our PTZ set. So we're going to include that in the XK24 to your buddy. I don't know if he actually would use them, but that was part of the deal. <laughs> so he's getting them. Um, and so anyone that actually has it dedicated for a camera, this is a really nice little accessory. Dean, are that. you watching, Dean? <laughs> it's your birthday. So excited. Yeah, so we make a couple different sets. We're, we're experimenting more with these printed keys. One of the great things about XTs is that you can relabel them on the fly and, ch and change the functions right off the bat. Like I know there's different keyboards out there that may have little screens underneath and um, they, they compare a little bit to ours, but this way you can actually change it on the fly. Well, these acrylic ones, if you're not going to be in that situation, they're a great um, dedicated set that you can right. just install and not have to worry about it again. So we go both ways. It can yeah. be legends on the fly or install some nice acrylic keys and if you need to mount your x keys we have that solution as well there you go <laughs> got fixed mounts we have rack mounts a lot of people are using the xk40 now in a rack mount situation yeah. uh, we have a guy that was just talking about it in our x keys group he had three of them hooked up i think he was running um wirecast too he got a 128 yeah. for wirecast hooked up yep so that was cool to see all right i'm gonna cool well yeah. i think this is Sorry, awesome I and i love that your products are made here in america yes we have yes. a lot of our products made here in the usa for sure it's awesome and i do want to give a shout out to our own company we were talking about what we've been doing to try to help um we were actually approached two weeks ago from a company here in michigan that was sourced to find solutions to help get gm going building these ventilators everything was stopped building cars and they switched over to try to help. And so X keys were actually used on one of those lines. So a woman called me in desperate needs, actually wasn't even in the office. I had to use Daniel from the warehouse, shout out to Daniel. He <laughs> went on my computer, I remoted in, printed a label and we got him one next day air. So they're using the XK3 switch interfaces on the production lines to help efficiently get those ventilators built. So that was something very proud of with that. So. Wow. Thank you. Yeah. You know, it, yeah. it's incredible. Everyone has, everyone is, is pitching in and it, it really takes a village. Um, you know, you guys are, are printing the key. They are punching the buttons, you know, and yeah. other people are on the front lines and everybody's really pushing together. Um, you know, we gave away a camera and you gave away the keys to someone who is using them to help, people find out about the latest research on um, rare diseases and who knows so where great. that person could be in Florida, in Mexico, in yes. anywhere, Afghanistan, and they may have this rare disease it, before that time of streaming and understanding how to use this technology. It would have been those people in the room, you know, and yeah. so connecting, mm -hmm. connecting that to the world is so important. So thank Absolutely. you for everything that you're doing, everybody. And, uh, and that's what I wanted people who are watching to remember is that, you know, you can learn about the X keys, you can learn about all of these guests, but you probably know 10 times as much as the next person uh, who's at your local church or at home. So use this information to do some good and help help other people. Absolutely. And uh, if Dean's watching right now, we do have tech support working every day still. So please do not be afraid to reach out. If you run into any problems, we'll love yeah. to help you set it up. You can shoot us an email, tech at xc's.com. Um, and we'll get back to you as soon as we possibly can. That goes to everybody too. Everybody, not just <laughs> Dean. But yeah, if he's watching for sure, do not be afraid to, to reach out. You must be live streaming rare diseases in order to get tech support from XC. <laughs> exactly. Just kidding. Thank you so much, everybody. Thank you, Maggie. Thank you, Miranda. You guys Thanks, are the best. Paul. Thanks for having Thanks us for on. Having you guys us. take care out there. Stay safe. Stay healthy. All right, everybody. Stick around. Just 60 seconds, and we're going to bring on Matrox. They're going to talk about their new releases at NAB. Let's do this, everybody. We're watching in the chat. You can join Maggie and Miranda on the Zoom breakout session.